like a linebacker. He got kind of low and grabbed my waist. It was a crime that captivated audiences. Now the Jodi Arias case is being re-examined, particularly her claim that she killed her ex-boyfriend, Travis Alexander, in self-defense. Jodi's trying to run out the room, but Travis is behind her. She remembers that Travis kept a gun. The two-hour special on Discovery Plus takes viewers through the crime scene and retells Jodi's story from her own testimony, claiming that she killed Alexander after he attacked her in his home. It also includes excerpts from Jodi's diary about her state of mind, as well as new interviews with her defense team. I think every, almost every defendant is not truthful with police when they're first arrested because there's always that hope that maybe, maybe I can get out of it. I think it's self-preservation. I think it's kind of standard for most defendants. During the interview with Detective Flores, there was a videotape that was running and one of the things that she did was sing and another one was stand on her head. The prosecutor also speaks out, standing by his case and the evidence that convicted Jody of first degree murder with a life sentence. While her trial may be over, it seems questions about this case still linger. For Inside Edition Digital, I'm Mara Montalbano.